Since you uh, won the race at Darlington, you think you're doing the business of winning the big ones now? Well, I certainly would like to uh, to win a big race on every racetrack, but uh, it won't change my approach to any of the races, I don't think. Every race that I enter, I try to win it, but my approach as to how to win a race may be a little different from other drivers. Well, what was the biggest factor in your favor at Darlington? Well, the stamina of the automobile, I think, was the big thing. It stayed there and ran uh, consistently all day long. I did have some heating problems at the end of the race, but fortunately I didn't have to push the car at that time because the chief competitors, Daryl Derringer and Fred Lorenzen, had uh, encountered some trouble, so it sort of left me home free, so I could baby the car. All right, now, are you running at Richmond this uh, weekend? Very definitely. I will be running in the Capital City 300 on Sunday afternoon. Now, uh, what's your opinion on, uh, should there be more factory backing and racing today? There's not as much this year as there has been in other years. Well, that's true. In fact, Ford has been the only ones that's been sponsoring their cars this year. It would have been better if we had had a variety of manufacturers in with a variety of cars so that we could have had Richard Petty, David Pearson, Bobby Isaac, and some of the other top drivers competing in all of the races. As far as uh, my opinion of factory back cars, I'm in favor of it. I think that it adds a lot to the sport. It uh, enables us to put much better equipment uh, before the fans, and uh, of course it gives the manufacturers a lot of engineering data that goes into building better and safer cars for our highway uh, driving pleasure, and I'm always in favor of, in favor of that. All right, thank you very much, Mr. Yeah, thank thank you. Darryl, uh, you had some tough luck at Darlington there. Do you think you might come up with another big one before the season's over? Well, Bill, we're going to run all the major races. I, uh, for the rest of the season, definitely going to run Darlington and we're going to run Rockingham. Is Martinsville uh, set yet? Yes, uh, Martinsville is in... Uh, if our funds hold out, I should say, because uh, we... Uh, Back in our own cars, you know, uh, there's nobody sponsoring the Mercury team, so we have to go according to our expense account. Now, is there any chance of Mercury sponsoring uh, cars, factory backing them in the future, or a chance of you going to another car if you can get factory backing? Definitely Mercury isn't going to run in 1966. Uh, they had planned on it, but something happened uh, in their budget or something, I guess, so we're going to... Uh, Probably make a move, but I don't know where to. I don't know what companies are going to be in racing next year. I'd like to see them all get in. Now, do you think if factory backing continues at its low ebb it has now, that uh, the independent driver is going to be on the way out eventually? Well, it definitely hurts the independent driver because, like I say, we've suffered a lot, but we've been fortunate enough to finish to help keep our head above water. But uh, if I run two cars like at Darlington, if I hadn't finished as well as I did, we just about broke even there with taking two cars.